I know the cops saw me. I don't know if the other ones did. They all started doing a weird dance, so... They might be coming? Cop for sure. I wonder if I got level 5 blunt, because I am I seem to be doing pretty good damage now. Uh, no, we're still at 4. It is going up, though. I see two dogs down there now. I think this is a slow zombie. Oh, somebody else heard. Another cop. And I think the one that I was shooting rendered out. I saw it disappear there. That's no good. So that one was replaced with a cheerleader. So I've just got to bring them close enough. Uh, and then they won't disappear on me. Oh, come on. The dogs seem to respawn in the same spot, though. <laughs> okay, it looked like I got them both with one arrow, but I think the spikes got one of them and I got the other one. Slowly but surely. I think that's a spitter down there. Still seeing uh, quite a few of them, three or four for sure. This will just uh, keep bringing them over. Oh, there's stuff on the ground right here. Yeah, right there. There's lots of stuff on the ground here. Not really good stuff, but four pieces of ground loot. I see dogs over there. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of in the middle of a whole bunch of them here. I hear something. Right there. I don't like it when they get that close. I hear something. It's gonna run back and uh, 
check on those other arrows. I don't want to run out. I know I got lots, but you never know. And I want to make another bow here. Uh, what am I missing? Wooden stick. Why do I keep thinking that takes a log? Unless I had it on the wrong thing. I don't have any rocks. There's one. Still that mushroom up here. I don't want to forget it before I leave. There's another one. It is a log. Okay, so I had it right. I'll let that cook. Uh, I've got some more arrows coming. I'll grab a few more sticks. Just to be sure I have lots. Actually, these uh, mid trees, these middle trees, I guess. They give me four sticks apiece, but they also give me a log. And they take as many hits as the saplings. Want to be a little prepared prepared here. Uh, drink a little more water. Break these guys down. So I haven't really found any tradables. What I really need is a... Uh, I'm just going to swap that out, that bow. What I really need is some batteries or something. Because right now I don't have anything. Still. All right, this is actually a pretty good setup here that I have. And I think we're gonna head in for some more. Just to make sure that I have enough. I got lots on me, but I just wanna get some in the queue just in case I run out. I think that'll be enough. Grab a couple hours because my energy is getting low. I just want to be fully prepared before I go back in. There we go. Just save my game real quick. And uh, we'll see what the pop-in looks like here. Or the redistribution. See a dog there on the left. As much as I hate those dogs, they're always welcome because they offer uh, fur. So I can make more bows. Gotta be careful here. Oh, I did get him. Look at that. Here he comes. Holy crap. I just jumped. Oh my god, he's fast. Well, he didn't get me down on my antibodies. Very little damage to my health. But at least I got another fur. And my gear is... Oh yeah, he hurt my gear. Try to get back in here. Save my game. Holy cow. See if I can bring a couple back with me. The sooner I can get them killed off, the easier it's going to be. Let's 
see what my traps look like here. Whoops. Wrong button. I guess it's one way to fix it. Destroy it and rebuild it. I meant to repair it. And this one here, it looks pretty good. And I think we're good to go. Some of those shots, like, do so much damage. I don't know if there's crits in this game, but some, some of my shots will, like, tear them apart. And then others, it, it'll take, like, it's almost like it's not doing any damage. It'll take, like, five or six shots. Oh, no. Oh, man, he just about got me. Here comes the rain, I think. At least it'll keep my hygiene in a, at a good level. There's a lot of arrows for two zombies. Oh. He's a runner. Have a look down here. I don't see any more zombies. I'm not sure. Did I check this trailer? I'll have a look here. Door's closed. I haven't checked it yet. Uh, I'm not going to use a lockpick. I, I have a crowbar on me. Maybe I'll run back and grab my crowbar real quick. And just keep it on me. I don't need that pistol that I have because I have no ammo for it. And if I do, it's, I don't know, it's somewhere. It's annoying. I'd rather have the crowbar. Let's have a look down here real quick. Oh, there's another zombie there. Maybe I can attract her or get her to come down this way. So I won't be able to hit her. It's weird. Little barriers like that. Oh, there's something there. Here they come. Oh, I heard something. Maybe not. Get that crowbar. And leaving, once again, leaving to grab the crowbar, going back to my car here, will reset their positions. So they'll they'll be in different places when I get back, I think. Perfect. For my short stones. Yeah, let's head back in and see if we can get in that door. See? Redistribution. I see three of them right now, and I had this area clear, so this is good. It works to my advantage, actually. No, no real damage. Can't get over the fact that I'm getting, um, taking this port with a wooden bow and stone arrows on hardcore mode. Just with a bow, no weapons. I mean, no guns. <laughs> this is pretty cool. Like, once you get used to how things work, uh... Once you get used to how things work, they uh, it becomes a little easier, but you can still get surprised for sure. Just repair this. You can still get surprised and get killed easily. Like, there's so many different ways to die, uh, especially with your antibodies. And these zombies, they hit really hard. Um, turn that up a bit more. 
Oh, right there. So every time I run back and and uh, reset their position, I I kind of look forward to coming back in and seeing their spawn locations changed, or them being right at the beginning here because I'm basically pulling them from the rest of the uh, the facility here closer to me, right, into the open here. I don't think it's as open on the other side. Try to get his legs. See if I can get his legs or her or whatever it is. See if I can loot. Another zombie down there. I don't think I can loot. Okay, so I lose lose the loot on that one and my arrows. Where'd he go? There he is. All by a lonesome. Come on. Dang it. trying to get him cleaned up. I need to get him cleaned up so I can run in. I heard something. Yeah, he had a buddy. Or is that the same one? I thought I knocked him down. I thought I killed him. Maybe I didn't kill him. Let's do a quick save. Oh, that took a big chunk of my crowbar uh, durability away. Way more than before. I think they increased that. That's a lot. Uh, all that for five plastic. Oh, well. The blow-up guy over there. Double check this one. I can't remember. I th think I was in this one. Maybe not. No, I haven't been in any of these. Uh, blueprints? Another metal bow. That sucks. I need the electric furnace so bad. I think that's about the last piece of the puzzle I'm missing here. I Did I get bullet production at one point? I, I may have. I don't know. It's put a lot of hours into this uh, hardcore. I have no idea. I'm so disorganized. I have no idea what's sitting at home and what's sitting in my vehicle. Uh, other than the ones that I just recently got. I um, wonder if I can... Get him to notice me. I don't know how to pull these guys. Maybe I can sneak in here. Maybe it won't do anything. Like he's totally ignoring me. That's okay. There's another one there too. This is so weird. It's weird to be this close to them. Where the heck is he going? Getting out of the rain, I guess. Uh-oh. Oh my god. Surprise. Oh. Well, at least I get another Venom. Oh, there's another one coming. Yeah, another one. Maybe now they're all coming around because this guy attacked me. Set up some sort of a... Yeah, there's a blow-up guy. Set up, so, set up some sort of a proximity alarm. Like maybe they're all running around to check out um, why he was making such a fuss over here. There's another one too. That's the guy that went into the trailer, I think. I'm going to start losing these guys on the ground. They're going to start despawning. Oh, and another one. Jeez. The cop. There goes the... The, uh... Spitter. And I lost that venom. No, there's some venom here. Oh, it's from the blow-up guy. 
I did lose a Venom. I hear another one. Better save my game just in case. Well, I guess that's one way to get them all to come around. Like, I don't see any down there anymore. I basically got them all to run around. That's great. And they were kind of funneled. I hear another one. Sounds like it's coming from down there. I don't want to get too close to the edge. I have a habit of falling off of edges. There it is. Here later. Here, another one. I really hope I find some batteries here because so far the loot's been kind of uh, basic, right? It's all been pretty much the same kind of loot. I really need something to trade. Or I'll have to move on to the next place and uh, try to get tradables out of there. I did get another pick, though. Guess she found her way up. Picking a sledgehammer. At least I can break those down. I can actually use the sledgehammer for uh, a weapon, too. They work pretty good for knockdown. I don't hear anything. I think I'm safe. Mm, big chunk of crowbar for nothing. Nothing searchable. This isn't looking good. Uh, I can maybe go into this building here. I think it's pretty safe. I think all the zombies that were... Oh, there's one there. I think most of them ran around and uh, came at me there that I, that I just killed. Quite a bit of stuff on the ground. There's some uh, there's some fuel here. Uh, I'm gonna have to get rid of some of this junk. Probably grab this fuel and then run back to my vehicle. I'm gonna be out of room unless I can find some more small items to fit. Yeah, I have to run back. Some more stuff on the ground there. Maybe some small stuff. Yeah. Great, I got all this fuel. Um, I don't like, I got tons of fuel now. And I just barely got in here, so there's gonna be a lot of fuel here, I think. Let's check to see what's in here first. Oh, another book. Some wire, uh, refrigerator. Dang it, I've already got that. So I got really lucky with some blueprints, but I think it's balancing out now. I'm starting to get doubles of the of things that I can't really use. I'm gonna have to empty out. So this morning, just uh, just so you know, yesterday was minus 38 Celsius. This morning is minus 43 Celsius. And that's without wind chill. They're calling for uh, up to minus 60 wind chill. I haven't seen weather like this in, in a, quite a while, probably about 10, 15 years. So, yeah, it's kind of an indoor day. There's not a lot happening uh, outside because this is the type of weather where things start to break if you use them, including vehicles, garage doors, front doors, back doors, that sort of thing. So, yeah, today's an indoor day for sure. I feel sorry for my dog. She's struggling with, uh, you know, going out and doing her thing because it's so cold. Oh, look at that. Delicious. 30, 30, 30. That should fill me right up. That's perfect. That worked out really well. Really well. I'll just drink some more water. Get rid of two of these at least. Look at that. Can't believe how far I've come. Like, 
quite a ways. Quite a ways. I've gone from struggling, looking for, you know, the simplest items, barely staying alive to, like, this. I mean, it's still not great. I'm, I still haven't really built anything substantial at home, but I really have been making it. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm making it. I'm doing well, I think. Hopefully I run into another dog. That way I can make another bow. I'll bring this bow with me, I think, because my bow is getting a little low. And if I have a spare, then uh, I won't feel uh, too paranoid. It'd be good to have a spare with me. I don't think I have any fur anywhere. Yeah, I'll have to uh, take that bow with me, that damaged bow. Just gonna put my bags back into my trunk here because they've been on the ground for quite a while and I don't want them to disappear for whatever reason. I don't know how it works, but at least they're reset in my trunk. And then I can dump them later. Grab some rocks. Try to keep that arrow queue up. I did go through quite a few there in my last run in. Got a couple mushrooms here, saving those, I think. That'd be nice to have when I run out of carbs. And then I've also got my fishing pole and stuff. I'll probably do some fishing before I leave here too. Because I don't think I have any fish left. And that fish is awesome. I hope it doesn't get rebalanced or anything. I, I think it's probably the best food, easiest food to acquire. And if they rebalance it, like... I don't see them doing that because it's tedious to get. You have to make the line. You have to have at least egg, what, three? Uh, make the line, make the bait, maybe egg two. I can't remember. And buy a fishing pole and go fishing. So, you know, the return should be as good as it is because there is a process, right? It's not like finding a can of food. But I guess growing your own vegetables uh, is a process too. So that should give uh, a decent return. Going to wait out a few arrows here, reorganize a little bit, drop my bags again. I think we're good. Oh, I got those blueprints. I got to get rid of those. And this iron bars, venom. May as well clean this up a little bit. There, I think we're good to go. Grab some more arrows. See a guy on the other side of the fence there. Uh, two of them actually, one close to me and one further away. Wonder if I can get to him. Ah, I'll leave it. Oh, there's another one. See if I can get his attention. And I can't. I feel like there's another one here. I hear... Doesn't look like he set off any proximity alarm. The other zombie's just kind of moseying around. Let's get back in here. I don't know why that would have reset. I didn't log out or anything. But it did. Well, I guess it works like the zombies, right? The whole thing kind of resets. I've been in here. Yeah, this is unlocked. So at least the lock didn't reset. I don't hear or see anything. I think that zombie I was looking at through the fence there on the other side of those trailers. It should be okay to go in here and start looting, I think. Yeah, I'll just get this place cleaned up. This stuff takes so much room. I'm going to be making so many trips back and forth. I might actually bring my car 
bring it a little closer. Oh, what was that? Wire, where is that? Oh, it's right on the ground. Holy cow, is that ever camouflaged? It's like the exact same color as the, uh, the concrete or the pavement. I don't see any more, though. I'm finding quite a few electric mortars, so maybe... I'm going to see what they're worth at the trader. Like, as much as I don't want to get rid of them because I need them for, like, uh, the thermal generator and any electric traps that I build, um, I want to see what they're worth. If they if they got good value, I might actually trade a few of them. I'll never get them back again, though, because what I loot is... That's it for loot, right? No respawn on the loot. Not seeing anything. Let's double check down here. Uh, that's a cool looking chip. I am definitely not going on it though. I am not risking everything, everything I worked for, just to be curious. Uh, zombie way down there. I just saved my game. Been a few minutes since I last saved. Oh, there's one. Uh oh. Oh my, he's a runner. Oh, he got me. Oh, and another one. Oh no. Oh my god. I'm gonna like back into the ocean here or something. Oh, get away. Oh, and another one. <laughs> Holy cow. At least they're not like super sprinters. She's got skinny legs. I keep firing the uh, arrows through her legs there. Wow. Oh, yeah, I got tagged. I lost another 10 points of antibodies. I'm done at 24 from 34 to 24. So a couple more of those hits and uh, and I'm dead. Damn. I see some more walking down there. Oh, they're they're checking out what the commotion was. I might as well bring them over if I can. Oh, I don't think I'm going to get him. Moving a little too fast. So yeah, the loot is... Like, there's nothing special about the loot. There's nothing... Uh, better swap my bows out there. There's nothing... Um, like, sure, there's a couple of blueprints here, but the level of loot is pretty low level so far. Sort of, I guess. Like, there's no advanced parts. Uh, and a lot of industrial facility type items. I'm full again. I gotta run back. This time I think I'm gonna bring my car down, though. Yeah, the loot is pretty much the same all the way through. I'm not seeing anything tradable. At least the other industrial facilities had batteries or solar panels. I mean, those are worth something. But here, there's there's nothing. I don't think it. I don't think I've seen anything higher than a, like an electrical component or a barrel of fuel. I guess. I'm not including the blueprints. There was a couple of blueprints here, but I won't include those. But it's turning out to be another really good spot for ground loot. I had never considered it, so now I'm going to have to think about the other ports in the game too for ground loot. You know, I might actually build a couple more benches here, uh, a couple more workbenches, and just leave them here because I don't think I'm going to be able to bring all this stuff back with me. There's quite a bit. So I think that's what I'm going to do. And that way I can uh, come back whenever for, like, maybe I'll just leave it as a fuel depot or something like that. No, I'll probably bring the fuel with me. We'll just, uh, we'll take another run at it here and see how... If I keep running into like really big items, and if so, I'll end up building some benches for storage, and then I'll just have to come back for it. It's not that far from home, actually. 
Just park it right here. I'm just looking for repositioning of the zombies because I did leave. So whatever's left should have repositioned a little bit. So they could be anywhere, basically. Even the areas that cleared out. So I gotta be a little cautious. I'm down to 24 antibodies and uh, I'm gonna have to be a little more careful now. My next visit should be to like a hospital or something. I'm going to have to look on the interactive map or I should look on the interactive map to see where I can find a hospital and maybe try to get into there. Oh my God. Didn't even hear this guy. I just barely caught him in the corner of my eye. And he was coming. Another one. Maybe I can get him down here. Ah, dang it. Yeah, the loot is, is pretty much the same throughout. There's not a lot of variation. But there's a lot of it. Like, I'm maybe not in the containers, but most definitely on the ground. There's quite a bit of loot on the ground here. Someone was asking in the comments if I was thinking about going towards, uh, if I was ready to start, u oh, I see some stuff on the ground there too. Grab this oil. If I was ready to start using weapons like uh, firearms, and I'm not, not until I can get that machining table built and make sure I can make my own ammo. There, otherwise, there's no point yet. I've got to, like, this is such a slow process to get to that point. I'm not sure if I need the electric furnace for that i don't know where else to make the casings the machining table i think you can make the casings in the machining table so i should be able to do it i'll have to look at my tech tree at some point here but like no i'm not i'm not close to firearms yet i don't i just don't have the ammo and there are no places i can think of where i can get ammo where there where's my crowbar where i can um there, that are open enough for me to uh to take on with a bow and arrow you got to consider that too right like close combat is not an option for for me especially with my antibodies being so low or stuff on the ground there see it's all pretty much the same there's a few tools steel a couple steel axes i'll break them down i don't i think i only got one use left out of this knife here i don't have any stone i can't make another one But like that wire and the electric components, I think I need quite a few of those for the solar array. So it's a really good thing to be finding here. I'll just save my game because, well, because of that big crash I had. My computer has blue screened twice in the last year, I think, or even longer. It could even be longer. And both times it was while I was playing this game. No one survived. I've played a ton of other games and I've had no issues, no crashes like that. So this game for some reason shuts me right down. Let's see if that guy will uh, make his way to the front of the vehicle, to the front of that truck and I can take him out. My bow's turning red. Would have been nice to see another dog. I need, uh, I think I'm, I'm short one fur for another bow. Oh, there's quite a bit of stuff on the ground here too. Yeah, this area should keep me busy for a bit. But again, it's the same, same as everywhere else. There's nothing special. Take a quick look above, see if there's anything on top of the containers. Cause sometimes they do that too. Put loot up there. So one thing I've noticed, the industrial areas used to have a ton of nuggets. And, like, you get so many nuggets out of uh, uh, an industrial complex, but now there's, like, nothing. Barely any at all. So they cut that back, too. And it's not because of my loot settings. Even on my, um, my easy version or easy save, I'm full again. I'm not finding near as many nuggets. I don't think I can really make any room here to make this work. I'm going to have to... Uh, 
Yeah, I'll just maybe have a look, see if there's anything else small I can fit. What do we got up here? Fuel, or is that another... Some plastic concrete, I can fit those. Yeah, I'll just get these small items and then run back to my car, unload, and uh, head back in. My energy's kind of low too, so... Um, I know I just drove my car here to this end, but I'll probably end up uh, driving it back and getting some sleep. I got to keep that energy up to keep my stamina up. And I don't want any negative effects on my carbs or protein. Get back to my car here, run back to camp and, and get get freshened up, I guess. Maybe eat some food too. We'll, 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 we'll see. Now that I'm not worried about a full respawn anymore, I know what I've got to deal with in there is just basically what's left over. There might be one or two that do respawn back in, but nothing too severe. May as well grab these mushrooms and cook them. Oh, look at that. There's a dog down there. I really want that dog. I don't want him to disappear. I really need that fur. Because my bow is just about done. Uh, probably need to make some room here. Oh, I don't even have a knife. Just save my game. Is he still there? Yeah, he's still there. I'm going to go grab a knife. Or some, some material to make a knife. Just need one stick. There we go. Hopefully he didn't disappear. Uh, I think he's gone. Nope, there's something there. What is that? On the other side of the fence. Yep, there he is. Awesome. Right on, now I can make another bow. I'll grab something to eat and make another bow. Now I'm feeling pretty good. Things are looking up. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to make a couple of workbenches here too. So I'm running out of room. I feel like I'm missing a mushroom. Didn't I grab two? Dang it. I bet I was full and I dropped it on the ground. Yeah, I don't see it. And it's not in the bench. I must have dropped it on the ground. Oh well. Let's see if I can find it here. Ah, screw it. I'll just eat the one. That's fine. I don't want to waste too much time on it. I'm sure it's there. I'll grab it later. I'll just have to uh, tab open and, and do a search. I just I want to get this place finished. Maybe grab some more water too. Well, what do I got left? Not much. Oh, I got a little bit. That's good fresh food. I'll probably save that. I have more room in my packs than I thought. I thought they were pretty full. Take some jerky. In case I run into that other mushroom and then I can make some minestrone. Let's 
build another one here. Get that mushroom down. Should be enough to hold me over for a little bit. I think I might grab my other bottles and get some water here. Get cleaned up too. Guy on the other side of the fence there. Don't think I can hit his feet. No, I'm just gonna pull him out of there. Oh, there's another one. Must be getting down to just about, uh, like, the last couple of zombies here. Like, I must be. Might actually be close enough with my car there that there shouldn't be any repositioning of the zombies. I think it should stay about the same or what it was when I uh, when I went to go unload.
No, these are searchable. They're not searchable anywhere else. Just here. Uh, not much in them. I might have to run back through the yard there and uh, just quickly run by these and make sure, you know, um, make sure they're all, they've all been checked to see if I can search them. I think this will be the last uh, last door for my crowbar there. I think it's going to be gone. Yeah, there it goes. <laughs> All that for nothing. Oh, well. Empty, empty, empty. I don't remember where I left off here. I check these piles over here to see if they're searchable, though. Oh, I don't know if I got room for all those. Might have to come back one more time. I think that's it. back to camp get everything cleaned up and uh try to get everything organized see what i'm going to leave behind because i don't think i have enough room to bring it all with me but that was pretty successful i took the port with a wooden bow on hardcore mode excellent <laughs>